What up guys, it's AP back here with another video of Honest Judgment, and this time I'm going to be doing a vlog type thing. I don't know, I just feel like it'd be fun to do something to do, and then just have you guys come do my shit. But uh, yeah, uh, I'm getting some pretty weird looks <laughs> from people. I don't know. But yeah, I have a lot of shit to do, shit to buy, and I don't know. So we'll see how this goes, see if I continue it or not. But yeah, let's get to it. So I'm going to Best Buy today because I want to pick up a monopod for this thing, like a selfie stick because I want to try to vlog more and it's kind of like I don't know I'm not used to people looking at me when I'm vlogging so it's like kind of weird so I just gotta start you know getting used to it. Sorry if the audio's bad I'm using like a shotgun mic some shitty cheap one that I got off of Amazon I bought it a while ago but yeah so I'm going to Best Buy right now yeah let's let's see what they got hopefully I can find one cheap but yeah So I did end up picking up uh, this uh, monopod and it's called a, it's by Sunpack, it's the 6700M and um, it's $20.99 but uh, online they had it on sale for you know like 15 bucks which is you now, it's great you know that's a great price especially since I'm like still new to this thing so hopefully um, you know it's not as awkward carrying it and um, yeah but Sorry for like being all awkward in the first few clips. It's just that I'm not used to this type of thing, you know. And the reason I'm doing this is because um I feel like I should go out more often, you know. I've been like really sad lately and um I feel I felt like kind of like depressed the last few months and last 3 years actually, but um lots of shit going on, you know, personal problems and stuff like that. I'm just like you. But I feel like I just want to like record everything now, you know. I I gave up my passion for like photography and video making recently. But, um, I feel like, dude, I'm just wasting my time, you know, like, I should just focus on myself and, you know, go with the flow, so to say, and, uh, yeah, it's kind of weird, people are looking at me, but, um, yeah, so hopefully this, uh, you know, it's not top of the line, you know, because I'm just getting started, you know, I'm not Casey Neistat or whatever, but, uh, you know, I just want to make it a little bit easier for me holding it, and, yeah, it's pretty much like a selfie stick, and, uh, yeah, so... I picked that up and then right now I want to go get some uh, comic books, you know, from my local comic shop. Right now I've been, like, if you've been seeing my videos, is uh, I've been reading uh, Harley Quinn. And so anything Harley Quinn, Suicide Squad just came out. Um, not the movie, the actual comic. Based, maybe, I don't know if it's based off the movie, but it might be. But it's a new Harley Quinn, Suicide Squad. But, yeah, so let's get on to going with that. And then I'll... I'll probably unbox it and then like once I get to the comic book store I'll see how it feels and all that but yeah so let's go I just got to my comic book store. I'm gonna see what they have. My boy Kenny runs it. Nuclear Comics over here in, uh, what is this, Alicia? So, like Laguna Hills, Mission Viejo type area. So, SoCal. So, let's see what he got. The, actually, the model pad actually feels really nice. So, it's just weird because, like, like I said before, people look at you because this is ginormous fucking DSLR and shit. But, yeah, let's see what he got. It's 
Kenny. Avery, how you doing, buddy? Do you mind if I vlog or anything? No, dude. Do what you, do what you sure. gotta do. So I'm right here at Nuclear Comics with my buddy Kenny, owner of the shop, and it's located in uh, Mission Viejo or Laguna Hills. Laguna Hills, so over here in SoCal, and um, here's a little thing that you know, little promotion. Open since 1994, best selection of comics and graphic novels in Orange County. Huge on customer service and selection. If you want it, we got it. If we don't got it, we'll order it for you. All right, you heard it from the best right here. I've been coming here for months now, picking up the Harley Quinns, and then he's been, sh you know, he's really knowledgeable, showing me things that you know I be may be interested in. So hopefully, if you guys in SoCal come down and check it out, I'll put a link in the description of like the location and all that. But yeah. <laughs> so I'm back home now, and um, just got back from you know the comic book store, and um, I picked up some comics. So you probably saw when I was like. Uh, picking them up but uh, I'll show you what I got so I picked up Harley Quinn number two because she just got rebirthed sorry about the glare yeah she just got rebirthed so this is the second of the rebirth it's still the same writers from the new 52 which is Amanda Connor and Jimmy Palmiotti so you know I've been saying this in a lot of videos but um, I also picked up uh, the Suicide Squad one where it's uh, the rebirth and it's the one with Harley Quinn. I don't know if it's the same thing as uh, the movies that just came out. Um, I haven't even seen the movie, but you know I'm looking forward to the comic because comics are way better written than any TV show or uh, you know any movie out there because it's the, pretty much the origins of like where it came from. That's how the movies get made. And um, I picked up Batgirl, uh, Birds of Prey, and. Um, I haven't really read any Batgirl. I have issue number one, but you know, I just love her costume so much that like, I just want to start reading more of like Batgirl and the Birds of Prey and stuff like that. I don't really know any other story, but this one I just picked up on a whim. I've been seeing it like, I've been every time I go to the comic shop, I see this thing and um, it's heavy metal, and I'm a sucker for Betty Page, so I really had to get Betty Page, you know, anything that I can of her, so. What it is is um, what Kenny was telling me is a, it's like a, adult magazine type of thing, but comic books, you know, and he said like the art is like phenomenal and stuff like that. I don't really know any of um, cause this is issue number like. I don't even know. I don't know if there's issues for this, but this is one of them. I picked it up just because I had Betty Page, so don't really know what it's about, but I think it's interesting. And yeah, this is the end of my day you know unless I do something else then I'll put it in here but for now I'm probably gonna end the video and the reason I'm starting to vlog is because like I said before is that I kinda wanna you know go out more you know I've been pretty sad lately you know for the past like three years and stuff like that I wouldn't say like maybe depression and stuff like that but um I'm not, I don't want to be like those pe people that post everything like, I'm so depressed, I need people's attention. I mean, like, yeah, sometimes I do feel like that, but, you know, the best thing I could say is, like, you know, if you are depressed, you know, talk to somebody, maybe talk to strangers, because, you know, talking to strangers seem more, like, helpful in a way, because sometimes your friends and your best friends, they will be there for you and they'll do anything for you, but sometimes, to me personally, it feels like I burden them, you know what I mean? Rather than being anonymous online or something like that saying you know what's on my mind so I kinda wanna make this vlog series is just like kind of like an experiment for me for my personal gain so I could you know you know be happy again you know I, I haven't been happy in a while so you know if you guys aren't happy you know try to change that slowly I know it's a very very hard burden and all that because you know I'm there right with you you know so you just gotta do things that you know will keep you occupied that's things you like even if you lost passion like how I did I lost passion for photography and video work and stuff like that and I just started thinking I was like dude it's something I really like and I'm wasting time if I don't do anything with it you know I'm still young especially if you're young or even if you're older like it sucks depression sucks and um, it's not it's never a competition saying like oh my life is harder than yours and stuff like that like 
don't give me that bullshit because everybody has their own problems, you know? So, this is my kind of like release of like, I just want to record everything and like what my daily life consists of, you know? So, it's kind of like a lame journey that I'm doing, but you know, I'm just trying to like better myself and stuff like that. Be who I used to be, you know? I, I may not show it most of the time because putting on a fake smile sometimes is really hard. But, you know, maybe with this, I could do things, you know, that... Because I'm scared to try new things, you know, I'm content with, like, how things are, but, like, you know, that's not what life's about. It's about taking risks, you know, and, you know, I just, you know, if, if you guys have, you know, depression or dealing with something, talk to somebody. Do something that you like and stuff like that. But, yeah, I'm going to end it here. Hope you guys have a good one.